Abraham Lincoln Birthplace National Historic Site. Find your park. I don't want to find just one park. I want to find them all. I am at the Lincoln Birthplace. The museum, memorial building, boardwalk going around. Let's go check this out. Over here, we have the Nancy Lincoln Inn, and in 1928, James Howell built the inn and named it in honor of Lincoln's mother. It was to accommodate an increasing number of tourists who were coming through rural Kentucky and wanted to visit the birth birthplace and memorial museum. Now, James Howell, who built the Nancy Lincoln Inn, was the descendant of pioneers and as such would have had a vested interest in this land and of course it would give him a great view of this building first monument to abraham lincoln inside this building is a historic cabin and over here next to it that hole is actually the spring that led the family to settle here that's would have been their water source And now, it's up the boardwalk to the cabin. Let's see what the plaques have to say. The information here usually supplements the film that they have at the visitor center. It's about 15 minutes long. The Lincolns typified families who settled on the Kentucky frontier in the early 1800s. The film said that they would have been middle class, maybe even upper middle class which kind of surprises me because I always think about him being growing up kind of hard scrabble, very, very poor. But for the Kentucky frontier, that wasn't the case. Kind of blows my mind. And this is the front of the monument here. These are the 56 steps leading up to the front door that we can't use because of construction that's going on. This is actually the back entrance, but it's the one we can use right now. Folks are welcome in whenever you're ready. Okay. We're just working on the door a little. So pets are not allowed? He's a service dog. Okay. The Abraham Lincoln Historical Park. Please do not touch the log in. So I can't get any footage of what's inside because we can't get in there to see anything. I guess it's empty. Okay, this is an 1840s cabin at the Abraham Lincoln birthplace. It would have been representative of the cabin. They said this is not the actual cabin. The National Park put it there to give us an idea of what a cabin in the 1800s would look like. It was built around the time that Abraham Lincoln was born. Shall we make our way back? Okay, here we go. This trail apparently leads down to the parking lot that's right in front of the visitor center. It's concrete. Now I have to decide if I want to do the boardwalk or try the trail. That's got steps. We'll do the boardwalk. Before we go, I've got to get my National Park's passport book canceled. I'm 
collecting my cancellations, that's for sure. Now our visit's complete. The Abraham Lincoln Boyhood Home at Knob Creek is just up the road. There's no admission at either location, and it'll take about two hours total to do both of them. The bookstore is located at the Abraham Lincoln Birthplace, which is open 9 to 5. And here's the dog. Yes, that was a squirrel. Oh, come on. You know better than that. Tell everybody to like and subscribe. So help us out. If you like the video, give us a big thumbs up on the like button. Here are some end cards with links to more great videos. And don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you out, about, and online. Bye!